Life hacks according to psychology. Confrontation. If you think someone is going to go off on you in a meeting, sit right next to them. It's extremely awkward talking bad about someone and being aggressive when they're so close. No one wants to sit right next to the person they just badmouthed, so they'll take it easier on you. The Earthworm Destroyer. Do you have a song stuck in your head that you'd like to forget? Think of the end of the song. According to the Zygarnik effect, your mind tends to think of things left unfinished, so thinking of the end of the song will close close the loop and allow you to get the song out of your head. Build attraction. When first meeting someone, if you do go for a handshake, then make sure your hand is warm. It makes you seem much more inviting than a cold hand. Also, when you're with that person, subtly mimic their actions and posture. It builds trust and it makes you seem like you two fit together better. The broccoli trick. If you want your kids to eat broccoli, ask them if they want two broccoli stalks or five. Instead of just asking them if they want broccoli, this way you've already made the choice for them but they'll feel like they're getting a great deal by choosing the amount of broccoli they want. You can expand this trick to other situations too. The paternal wisdom. If you want people to take you seriously, tell them what you say is what your father taught you. People tend to believe fatherly advice inherently. The dollar auction. Gather a group of friends together and hold up a one dollar bill for auction. Tell them that whoever gets the high bid wins the dollar, but whoever gets the second and third highest bid will still have to honor their bid. Then sit back and watch as the bid goes from pennies to four, even five dollars or more. How quickly your friends will forget the value of a dollar. So agreeable. When asking someone a question, get them to agree with you by simply nodding your head. The action makes them start to think that what you're saying is true and that they should nod yes too, since our behaviors are social. The stalker detector. Ever get the feeling that someone is watching you but you're not sure? Try yawning and then glancing at your suspected stalker. If they yawn, then you know they've been watching you, since yawning is contagious. Rock, paper, scissors. Become a champion at rock, paper, scissors by asking someone a question right before starting the game. If you ask, then immediately start into the rock, paper, scissors chant, they'll almost always defensively throw scissors. The Pathfinder. Ever wish you could clear Grand Central Terminal? In crowded areas, look in the direction in which you intend to go and watch the walkway just open up. In busy areas and crowded streets, people tend to watch other people's eyes to see which direction they will go so they can go the opposite way. What's up Psych2Go viewers, Donna here, and if you like that video, check out the article in the description below to see more of that stuff, and subscribe to the channel. Also, if you want to know more about me, I also do psychology stuff, so be sure to check my channel out in the description below. I'll see you later.